there were no people. And already the music's too loud. My goodness. I have no idea how well this is going. That's going all right. Wow, it's hot in my room already. I've barely started anything. Deacon's Christmas. All right. Um. Yeah, I was futzing around uh, with uh, stuff. I am winning. I am indeed winning. I believe I am winning. Uh, chat box. Let's move the chat box up a little bit. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, what else we do? Oh yeah, we gotta share the stream. We gotta share the stream all over the place. That's a very good idea. We gotta. We gotta let people know that uh, stuff is happening. Let's. Meaning no. Every stream starts with me telling people about the stream. It's very meta. And let's go here. And where is we? We is here. And yep. And we is also here. And we is also over here. <coughs> Blurg. And we is here. Cool. And I just realized that streamer mode is a thing that exists on Twitch, so that's good. Uh, background noises are... Uh, which background noises? You mean the music or just the, the other stuff? Omnipresent indeed. Okay, what are we doing? What are we doing, guys? What are we doing? We're doing this. Okay. Right, we've got some people here. Actually, my, what? How the hell is it so warm in my room? Hang on, gotta open the window. And the socks come off. They must come off. Okay. Stream hype. Uh, I got the well, no, uh, Boba Fett. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got the chat working for YouTube. Okay, 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 okay. We've got people in here. We've got the hype train, kind of, sort of. I still don't know how the hype train works at all. Okay, so the plan is, uh, as per title, we're making a hydrofoil, combining a whole bunch of suggestions, and. Um, yeah, so a bit of a confession to make, I might have gotten excited last night, instead of going to bed early so I could be uh, all big brain uh, for today, I made the turrets of this thing preemptively, so... Is the music loud enough? Nope. Okay. Oof. Okay, where are we? Test fortresses... And turret arrangements, and... Yeah, so I, uh... I might have made the turrets a bit early, and I even uh, did some deco on it. So, as per suggestions, it's got a uh, giant ass cram cannon on it. It's not that giant, it looks bigger because I, uh, I decoed some APS barrels on it because I think that looks cool. Uh, yep. Oh yeah, don't worry, I've got... I've got hydration right here. Although water would be a good idea. Hello, hello, hello. Conveniently, I have a water bottle right here. Fancy chat. Yes, indeed. <laughs> Bleh. Okay, I'm hydrated now. Hydrated with an eye. Okay, wh where were we? Alright, so we've got... We've got a cram cannon. That is a frag penetrator. Not a bad one, either. Lucked out and made uh, one that's somewhat decent, actually. Yeah. Hey, glad to see you could make it, Slugmaster. 200? Am I reading that right? Yes, I am reading that right. Choo-choo. Alright, and we've got an APS. With, um... Uh, very deliberately uh, arranged swastikas in the back to not be the, you know, the bad one. Um, uh, possibly some of the worst APS Tetris I've ever done. Uh, this is definitely a burp gun. It uh, 
fires a long burst and then takes forever to reload, and it is combined uh, C-Wiz and just uh, shooty shooty. And we've got a particle cannon over here, vertical lens, and thump damage. Uh, two giant as uh, four giant as steam engines to power it. Separate AI for everything, and here are the ACBs uh, that's controlling how fast the particle cannon fires. And here is uh, the shell it's using. It's very fast and with flak and AG. Okay, so that's our stuff. We probably need to test this. Yep. Uh, Paragon, why, why uh, are you talking about? Uh, like, why the chat? It's for benefit of... Alright. Hello, Belgrant. Okay, so I should probably show off uh, some of these things just so people know what's what, and no better way to show it off uh, than with... Uh, where is it? Where's the Tortuga at? There it is. So, Tortuga... Tortuga is here. Ram goes, and now you'll see the particle cannon has adjusted how it fires so it can hit things. I really should change that so it doesn't miss so much. So, this uh, particular weapon setup, it makes absolute mincemeat out of small flyers. And the cram cannon is just doing its best. Wow, it just took down every single Tweety. Let's see if this cram cannon's actually gonna hit anything. That would be nice. Nope, it missed. Damn you to hell. Yeah, it's a Buddhist uh, swastika, by the way. Actually, there's many kinds of swastika, which is awkward. Because you know who they frickin... They frickin ruined it for everybody. Mm. Oh yeah, so um... Right, so yeah, that fr that frag cram it does lovely work in it, it? And this is just so uh, I could stick some extra recoil absorbers in here, just uh, attached like so, because um, otherwise it compromised the armor around the turret neck. That's no good. This is actually embarrassingly one of the better sea wizards I have ever made. <sighs> also, the tortuga is running very far away. Ooh, let's see where that cram went. That cram is poking holes straight through the Tortuga. It's great. Yay. Yeah, I think you know what I really need to do is set... I really need to set this to... basically zero. So let's just test that again, see if that works. And... Go, where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it? Where is it? Is that better? See, friggin' particle cans, man, they don't do as advertised. Well, okay, no, it's doing a little bit better now. Interesting, the Tweeties are... Either we damaged every single one of them, and uh... Yep, no, that works better. That works better, I'm gonna save this fortress right here. Okay then. It just occurred to me that um, since we've got a particle cannon, this thing will be able to fight submarines without needing torpedoes, and that's very convenient. This thing is also going to be uh, quite a close range beast, by the way. So let's just go here, and now let's actually get busy. Let's get busy. Here, so number three. I'm gonna save this fortress right here. Okay, let's go here and here.
What's the chat saying? Yep. Uh, what are we doing today? Driver, we are making a combined arms amphibious hydrofoil. And, uh, yeah, I got carried away last night and made all the turrets, so, yeah. Yeah, this is- this thing is on full focus, uh, by the way, just so everyone knows. Um, very much, uh, what do you call it? Yeah, just so uh, this is, um, a decently ranged pack. Decently ranged particle gun. Alrighty. Boop. Alright, you go away for a hot second, and now, let us... Uh, let us make salad. And how wide is this again? Alright, so we're gonna start building this thing from the front back, I reckon. So, cram cannon is in the front. I really do like that barrel. It, I don't know. It looks a little bit ridiculous, but I, I like it. <laughs> I like it a lot. Okay, we're gonna have a double layer of metal on the bottom, because that's a jolly 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 good idea you'll notice that I'm not doing the necklace turret thing this time it would feel weird um, and we, yeah, we can paint the bottom of this thing red there's no particular reason why we can't do that or shouldn't do that okay and here we have APS I think we're gonna have two of these APS turrets actually uh, because I like that and it's not gonna be a cheap hydrofoil craft it's gonna be going to be a reasonably, a reasonably big girl. And particle cannon is going to be on the back. And I think what we're going to have is just for safety. Uh, we're going to have an internal citadel, so that'll be the spaced armor. So here... alloy because uh, doubling as rudimentary spore liner I like it, I like it, I like it, it does. This thing is already going places. It's been so long since I've like made proper necked turrets that I've almost forgotten how convenient it is. There we go. There we go, cram cannon has a thing. How big? Uh, I don't know how big. This is one of those builds, I don't know how big it'll be. It won't be massive, I don't think, but um, it'll be reasonably chunky because the armor is going to be uh, reasonably thick. It's going to have four meters of metal uh, on the sides. Um, well, no. Uh, four, well, three layers of metal and a layer of alloy, let's say. Winning. Are you winning, son? Yes, Dad. Oh, we're winning so hard. We're winning so hard, you don't even know. Uh, one, two, three. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, one, two, and a few of these. Let's make sure this bad boy can float. So we can be sure the floaty thing is happening. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, please. There we go. Mm -hmm. uh, superstructure. Uh, yes, actually, I am. I wasn't originally planning to have a uh, superstructure on this thing, but I thought, you know what? I mean, I've been getting some good practice in with a uh, superstructure. Uh, functional, if not necessarily super pretty, uh, but yeah, it's going to have superstructure. Definitely going to have superstructure. You bet your sweet lippy, it's going to have superstructure. Yeah. So yeah, I d did I mention that um, instead of going to bed early like a responsible person, uh, I stayed up till about 12 a.m. doing this. Um, well, designing the guns for this thing. Uh, 
So yeah, I'm gonna be- it's gonna- it's gonna be one of those streams where I'm sleep drunk, high on caffeine, and with just, you know, judgment is a little impaired. Just a little bit. Just a teeny, itsy bitsy bit, not 100% there. Now, fun idea is, can this thing float already? Can they float, Georgie? Just this use of the fill tool. This the yeah. This is going to be a close range hydrofoil, by the way. Here we go. <laughs> okay, what is happening? What's happening? What's happening? Let's let's build some stuff uh, around this here gun. A bit of alloy around here. because I think the superstructure is going to meld in with this uh, barbette right here. Let's put an extra layer on here. Yes, I like it. Okay. Uh, heat and Hesh, well, it, it already has a spore liner of a sort because um, this is all metal. But there's a layer of alloy here with slightly less, uh, with slightly less AC, so, um, that's gonna be a little bit better than nothing. Uh, not perfect. Uh, also, uh, metal, the metal armor that's this thick tends to weaken Hesh quite a bit. And, yeah, put the chat a little bit more to the left, okay. Uh, let's put the chat here. How's that? Somebody say something, please. Somebody type. Alright. Never mind, I'm gonna. Thank you! Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, that's showing up nicely. Look at that. Look at that. That's beautiful. Slopes. Uh, what the, what the, what the. Where were we? Where were we? Where were we? We were somewhere over the rainbow. Okay. We were saving this thing. That's what we were doing. See, there it is. The Damn it. <laughs> there it is. There it is. Arms a week. Uh, uh, frig. Okay. Okay. Combine. Uh, combine. Arms. And. Fibius. Hydro. Foil. Okay. Alright, so I'm gonna do something a little bit weird, a little bit radical, and I'm going to make this thing slope like a canoe, but not at the angle it usually does. Hmm. Yeah, text, text is wanted. It's just so that uh, people watching this on YouTube later can see what I'm uh, responding to. Which is quite uh, quite useful, quite handy dandy. Actually, hang on a minute. Okay. This is actually going to be a lot harder than I would have thought. So we're going to slope this way. Or maybe not. Should we? We should. Okay. 
be less canoe and more the other thing. So it means we're gonna probably have to stick some uh, interesting missiles in this thing. Oh yeah, this is uh, this is actually gonna be quite sharky, ain't it? This is a nice way to get a long thing. Okay. Wasn't expecting to do a huge amount of science today, but it's been a while since I've tried to make a hull like this. So by gum, it looks like science is happening. Part of the reason I'm doing the slope like this is so it'll be easier to stick wheels on this. And where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Yeah, I like it. I like it. It's is this sufficiently not canoe-like for our liking, ladies and gentlemen? Corpse in the nose, exactly. Hey, glad to hear it, Cypher Anonymous. Hey. Yep. Yeah, well, sideways canoe doesn't count as canoe. Now, does it? Now, does it? <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. We are cooking with something. We are cooking with a jam. Or possibly pasta. <laughs> there we go. I like it. I like it. I does. gonna have to replace some of these things with rubber anyway. Yeah! It's a distinctive nose. Distinctive, I say. Lovely. Lovely jobly. Now. What was I gonna do with my life? What was I gonna do with it? I was gonna make the rest of this thing, actually. How big should the superstructure be? Just hold on a moment, I'm going to do some measuring. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This thing's not going to be really massive, but it's going to be a chonky one. Yep. It's not a canoe! Looks nothing like a canoe. What's wrong with you? Hydrofoil. <laughs> yeah. I kind of like how people are calling me soot now. Like... <laughs> I don't know, there's something there's something endearing about that. I appreciate it. Alright, now let us lettuce. Lettuce and cabbage and spinach and other green things that are supposed to be good for you. Don't eat spinach to get iron. Uh, damn it. Okay, there we go. Length, please. Yeah, and the booty is gonna look roughly the same as the front, just for now. Just for now, uh, because that's nice and easy.
Okay, so we got seawiz in the front, we got seawiz in the back, and we've got a honking big particle cannon that needs to go right the heck here. Yeah, that's looking like a hull. It's not that long. It's only. Huh. Okay, it is get it's already getting expensive, but that's mostly because of the particle cannon. And the APS. Yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm digging this, guys. I am digging it so far. Uh Yeah, BW yeah, yeah. BW Soot. Yeah. Like Sooty, I don't think of Sooty as myself or vice versa, but you know what? It's uh it's my icon, so people will do that. Uh yeah, mast of some kind of uh a mast, a ma yeah, a mast, a mast, a mast. Yeah, mast can probably happen. Let's just check this. What? How dare you? Speaking to this. Oh, you... Why does Alt-N not... Uh, excuse you? Excuse you? Excuse you? Uh, why... Why is... Hmm. That shortcut is really annoying. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. ay 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 Fully functional. Already had two cups of coffee. Mom spaghetti. There we go. Uh, bleep, there we go. Original scent of your craft, eh? Ah, oh, balls. Yeah. Toast. Thirty meters per second is decent for a ship. Uh, depends on the ship. If it's a surface displacement vessel. Uh, 30 meters per second is pretty reasonable. Uh, for a hydrofoil, that's desperately slow. And uh, for a submarine, that's really good. Alrighty. Can this thing float by itself? Because that is handy. Not entirely. There's a lot of metal on this thing. But that's okay. It can float. We have confirmed float. Now, what can we do here? Oh no. Well, I forgot something important. Didn't actually save prefabs properly. Uh, let's go over here, get this fella. please okay here is where we're probably gonna need uh, some delightful slopage what the hell uh-oh this thing isn't symmetrical Balls, the width is even. That's really annoying. Okay, uh, balls. Well, there's a quick fix for that. Um, where is it? Where's me? There it is. Bigs, this thing 
is 5 by 5, which means I can do which means I can do this. So let's seal this off nice and quickly. There we go, there we go, there we go. So here we go. <laughs> I'm going to sneeze. Cover your ears. <gasps> Ugh, squeeze me. Ah, cool. All right. What are we doing? Uh, we're doing this. We're going back over here, and we're putting some protection in between uh, this uh, volatile APS thingy and the rest of the ship. Steam. I haven't actually left myself a hell of a lot of room here, have I? We need four of these things. I might have to design a new steam engine from scratch. Actually, you know what I can do instead? That's probably going to be excessive, isn't it? That depends. Hmm. Need to one, two, three, four, five. Oh, that's tempting. Oh, that's so nice. We're doing it. We are doing it. People mentioned poles. We're gonna be doing it. Not perfect poles, but it will do. <laughs> in nice and neat this thing is gonna be powered by custom jacks so that is the plan all right now we need an AI compartment which we're gonna stick right here Bigger than I thought it would be. That's all for the bleeding particle cannon. <laughs> Bigger turbines, more efficient than. Mm, yeah. I might have to. You know what I could do? Assuming we need any extra power adjustment on this thing, which I don't think we will, um, we could just have this thing run off electric engines. It's gonna have custom jets on it, so... Eh, excuse me. Um, it's not gonna be a huge dealio. Motoring right along, I think. And I just realized we're gonna need uh, more than one AI because it's got. It's, we're gonna need three AIs actually. Right, so we're gonna go here. Wow, AI compartment is huge. I'm gonna have to stick more stuff uh, in the sides of it. Maybe I can stick ammo compartments there. That could be fun. Uh, all right. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, peep! I guarantee you, people have made a flying meg before. Okay. Okay. There, there, 
and just for giggles, I'm going to do that name dropping thing I do with uh, my Patreon patrons, and I'm going to name the AI after them. Because I can do that. I am a wizard. Okay, so. Who is going to be first? You are. Captain. Captain Young. Cram. And. Nav. And this guy. Will be. LT. Britain. Uh, APS Seawiz. And this guy will be LT. Whoops. I can never spell Lieutenant, by the way. That's why I'm just going AT. I hope. Can you hear that freaking leaf blower that's outside my window? Just curious. Oh boy. Uh, LT. Yeah, I guess uh, LT. Oops. LTKD Pack. Perfecto. Hey, LT Lieutenant. Thank you, Redney. Um, you know what? You're absolutely right. Let's let's be consistent. That might be too long for this though. Uh, uh, There we go. Alright. <laughs> oh dear, too many crazies on motorcycles. That's no good. Um, balls. What was I doing? I was doing this. No. Oh. Teddies. Okay. Um, hmm. This did not occur to me. This did not occur to me. No, it didn't. How to do this? Easy. Okay, time for the aim point. Okay, this I want five seconds. Clusters of blocks. Clusters of blocks. Per range. Value per range. Did that do it? Yes, it did. Over here. And over here. And here. No. And set all to zero. Weep. Weep. And over here. And lovely, lovely. Might have to make this thing taller depending on how much GPPPPPPP we actually need. See, normally I like to stick to detection on the turrets, but uh, in this particular case. Could we put little little ears on this, do you reckon? I think we could. I think I'm going to. Now, uh, driver, I tend to find that um, you get the best results uh, with uh, close-in weapon defense when you just uh, set it to track things uh, via range. Because if something's far away, I care less about it generally. Um, particularly, you want close-in stuff for things like suicide craft and small things that fly uh, over the top of you. So, yeah, I tend to find that's what works best. Um, yeah, what else can we 
do here. We can do. this actually it's not the best protection for these but um, might as well might as well transition one to two sloop yes 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 this is what we like this is what we are here for Look at that! Oh, <laughs> that looks funny! <laughs> that looks good, I like it. <laughs> um, former... For, ah, I can't pronounce your name. For me. Um, I have competed in exactly one tournament. Uh, didn't do very well because um, uh, I got over ambitious and promptly forgot all the things I keep telling other people to do. So, yeah, it didn't, didn't go super hot. I am planning on running one. I'm not sure when I'm going to do that, because I need to figure out how to get people's submissions in, in a way that doesn't drive me insane. Okay, let's not do that. in this thing. Alright. Uh, well, the wall one back. The back of the turret's made of wood is because um, it's already got two meters of metal back there and it doesn't really need a third layer and this is just to round the turret out because otherwise it'll just be flat and it will look terrible. So, weirdly enough, that wood is there for cheap looks. Also, I kind of like just sticking wood here randomly. It's something RLN Gaming used to do, uh, as a matter of fact. And I love that dude. some ammo. Wow, I am impressed by how well this thing floats. Hit it with Did that fry it? Nope, it didn't. Okay, it did. Damn it. Yeah, that did nothing. Alright. 
new plan, stick the surge protector somewhere else. That's better. Good, good point. Whoever said that. Uh, da, 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 da. Poles uh, for heat and hash defense. Poles have more health. Um, I'm not sure if they're better. They both seem to work pretty well. Alrighty, we're doing, we're doing pretty good. We need to just, uh, stick some stuff. It's not too much, it's perfect. I'm just going to I'm just gonna put some half measures of protection around here though. have ears and it looks very cute it looks so cute like oh my god guys but do you not see how cute this is yay each turret has character great da, 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 da. oh yeah I need a yeah I could get a range find a turret yeah, yeah, dedicated range fighter target, that's how we do. Alright, let's see, how much ammo does this need? More importantly, that's not gonna blow up, is it? That won't blow up, no. Alright, there is some ammo. Oh, wow. This thing doesn't need much ammo, as it turns out. Uh, where can we stick... This, though. Alright. How expensive is this? this? It's getting there. It's getting pricey. And we're just gonna do this quickly. What the hell? What is that? Yeah, here. What the? What the hell, man? I think we're winning. Okay, jolly good, jolly good. Let's build a superstructure, eh? Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Let's test what happens when one of them ammo gets uh, gets destroyed. Oh, are you kidding me? I didn't mirror mode this.
Okay, there we go. How much ammo do we need? Okay, then. Alright, we need more ammo, but that's okay. Let's just test if this works. This usually does work. It needs to rupture more than one compartment at once. Usually. Okay, what happened there? Yep. If one of them gets blown up, absolutely nothing happens. And it's fantastic. Alright, now we gotta stick some ammo here, there, and everywhere. So we're gonna stick some back here. Because we've got convenient space for it. Yes, we have another one of these, and it'll be Fan Dabby Dozy. go, there we go. Progress is happening. This ammo with full material? Yeah, can EMP travel corners? Uh, yep, 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 yep. It can, I believe. There we go. Hell yeah, this place is, this is going places, I like it. Okay, so we have one more of these, up at the front. And we have redundancy. More ammo than we know what to do with. Actually, wait a minute. Can we make that one space bigger, do you think? No, we can't. Okay. I'm sorry, I wasted everyone's time. Alright, now we are starting to sink a little bit, so we are going to need some power. Some le power. In order to uh, get this thing up and out of the water. Might need to dial down uh, how strong that particle cannon is. Is helium pumps. That might be a good idea. How is the pump leaking? What are you talking about? Where is the hole? What are you talking about? Like, re what? Where's the leak? There is no- oh, wait. Oh, it's getting in through the top. I think. No. What's happening there? The turret hole. Okay. Oh, yeah, they- mm, you're right. Mm, you're right. Stick a healing pump in the middle, then. Alright. This will be an air pump, then. And that will have to do... That's floating. That's floating a lot better. And... Air pump. Woo, baby! Oh, yeah. Now this th Now she's floating. Now she's floating like a dream. Mm. Uh, backup air pumps? Well... There's not much point to build putting more than one air pump in a space because if an air pump gets destroyed, it means the compartment is breached. 
So... Is this thing burning materials just by standing still? Oh no, uh, the guns are reloading, I think. No, they're not. What? Hang on. I think I need some more ACBs to control them steam engines, otherwise that's gonna be bad. Let's see, do I have a prefab for this very occasion? Darn it, no, what the hell, no. No, I don't want to do that. Set that to zero percent. I don't care if this thing sinks out of combat. There we go. That's more like it. Mm -hmm. Yay, steam! Okay, then, there's fun things we can do with this. You know what? I'm going to be a cheeky lad and I'm going to stick custom jets on the outside of this because we appear to have run out of significant hull room. But that's okay. Because we're going to make uh, some. Uh, what do we call it? I mean, we could stick like four um, custom jets on here, it'll be probably pretty cool. Alright, how many hydrofoil pods do you reckon this thing needs? Three or four? Hmm. Oh yeah, superstructure, that's an idea. Uh, let's go, actually. Let's do this with the superstructure. A superstructure of sorts, uh, not canoe shaped. My apologies. Hmm. Okay, so over here we're going to have a command center of sorts. didn't work as well as mine did. Let's do this instead. There we go. That works. Nah. Nah, 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 nah. Let us shamelessly copy. to have an impression of speed. We're gonna do this. <laughs> Walkable for fancy points. I do want Rambot to be able to see over the top of this front turret, which is why I'm doing things this way. Yeah. There we 
we go. And also... Hmm, we could drop that. How's that looking? That's looking... Interesting. Here, do this. Oh, not again. Oh my word, I hate Alt N sometimes. It's like it has one job and it can't do it. One job. Ah, oh boy. Alright, let's go here, do this, let's go here, do this. It's gonna be semi walkable. Semi walkable. Right here, then. Let's have some glass. That is two meters tall, so that people can see. And by people, I mean me, and by me, I mean Rambot. chat saying chat's not saying much that's okay chat can chat if they want to okay then and here is door and here is ladder and uh, where was I I was here we don't do health and safety here at Borderwise HQ <laughs> we could actually stick missiles in the superstructure assuming we have enough ammo Stick a radar somewhere. Just off center. Okay. See you, Slug Mazer. Smokestacks. Yeah, there'll be smokestacks. Or something. What's uh, what's something that's like smokestacks but not smoke in terms of uh, pretty factor? Hey, driver, that was me last night. Should go to bed, but won't. Ha 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 ha. Let's do this instead. There we go. Now we do this magic. Let's actually track this, so your 533 and APS is that and this is a flat zero. Okay, it's got a hat. Cool. Uh, is this safe to watch? I... It's about as safe as anything else on the screen, I guess. Hmm. Thank you, young Lucas. 
Super firing. Yeah, rangefinder turret. Good idea. Good idea, chump. Okay, how do we do that, though? Getting somewhere. One, two, three. Turret goes here. I think. Uh, what should the rain find a turret? Which one should attach to this thing? Yeah, just channel one. Forgetting that paddles exist in From the Depths. Um, just, it's one of those things I, I forget all about them, so yet to try them. Okay, this is kind of a funnel, but also kind of not a funnel. Funnily enough. Ha 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 ha. Go. We've got a rangefinder right here. Interesting. Oh yeah, I need to put a control seat in here. We've been going for an hour. Deacon's Christmas. I did not realize. And you know what else I should do? I should stick uh, munition warners all over this thing. Willy nilly. That sounded weird. And I apologize. Thing. 
It looks interesting. It doesn't look like anything I've made before, that's for sure. Why not a ship wheel? Because ship wheels are big. Yep. Oh yeah, I should set uh, firing restrictions on these turrets, shouldn't I? Actually, for, for what this thing's packing, it's still kind of cheap. Uh, what else can we do with our lives here? Uh, so we've got some munition warners. Let's have a few more. Let's have a tube. Let's have a decoration. A nice slope. Small circular outcrop into the lower superstructure. Okay, cool. That looks cool. Looks cool. I like it. What else can we do? We need something. We've got stuff pointing up. Yes, yes, yes. Um, yeah. It's enough munition warners just for the moment. And we can probably stick uh, secondary guns uh, just along the sides here. That'd be fun. That'll be fun and cool and pretty neat. Maybe simple lasers. Uh, but now, we really gotta get on. Ugh, oh, not again. C come on, really? Why does Alt N not want to go in the middle? What is wrong with you? Okay, okay, alright. Let us now have some hydrofoil goodness. Then. Yes, 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 yes. Reasonably thicker. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. Probably also where we're going to stick the wheels on this thing. Maybe. No. Wait. 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 Box missile launches probably. Okay. Let's try this again. Because I think I have an evil idea. Evil, I say. Evil, I just mean, you know, it's an idea. It's an idea. Because guess what? The wheels are gonna go right here. What does that say? <laughs> yeah, it's gonna just, uh, it's gonna have, um, yeah, it's gonna have wheels on the sides uh, of these uh, hydrofoil pods. And it's gonna be super sweet. It's gonna be so dope. It's gonna be the dopest. Okay, let's, let's go here though. And 45. Get rid of that spread. go and wheels mm -hmm. okay not much power use though doesn't need it Turn 
wheel. There we go. There we go, there we go. Hopefully that'll be enough. Let's see now. But true now. <laughs> Leave bottom open for wheels? Nope. We're going... I don't even know what. is going to have Okay, spot of neighbors wheel configuration Okay, no, that's too much Oh yeah, I forgot you could do that. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. The problem is though, uh, the front is going to hit things first. Oh yeah, you know what's a really good idea for this thing, since I'm going to put custom jets on it? One, two, three, four, perfect. Alright, sources, fuel. Extension, make it not bottom out. It's got wee legs. Yeah, I'm going to stick. What am I going to do? It's got little legs. It's got teeny little legs. <laughs> Itsy bitsy teeny weeny little legs. <laughs> All right. Uh, we do need uh, custom jets, and I think I'm going to be cunning. I'm going to use a prefab I've got just to make things easier. Bigger. This one, this is enormous. It's going to have four of them, and this is how it is going to turn primarily. hit the go forward button, can it go forward? It can, and it will. A little bit front heavy, but that's okay. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Whoops, too much. Freaking alt in. Okay, so this fella here. I uh, want this thing to have a positive. Hell yeah, okay. Let's see if this works. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. I don't like it, this thing. This is very unusual uh, design on my part. It doesn't... Things don't usually look like this for me. Let's 
So if I hit K, what does that do? Oh, hell yes. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Good idea, good idea. Okay, you can put it off for a hot second. Okay. Yeah, tail plane to the butt. Tail plane to butt. Do you want to add fins of some kind to this? Hmm. How to fit? shark fin on the front to control. Oh yeah, roll control. Roll control is important. Absolutely correct. looks really stupid and I hate it and I'm gonna get rid of it <sighs> Boy. Okay. I'm gonna add this though extra booty armor this means I'm gonna do this instead Old hand. Get out of the wood. There we go. There we go. There we go. We're gonna have sneaky, sneaky, uh, hidden your control. There we go. Nom 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 nom. Go. These things work inside the crop. That's weird. I'm gonna do the exact same thing up here at the front because I can. probably need roll. We will probably need to be rolling, 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 rolling. What? Wrong thing. There we go. So, me. There we go. So, if I. Hopefully that should work out well. What am I doing with my life? Okay, uh, let's not prefab the whole ship, though. That'd be... That'd be weird. Alright, so... Roll control. What we can do... We can have wee fins out here. We can have some fins over here, you see? Uh, you see? You see? You see? We 
we have a teeny tiny amount of engine power available, so we should probably use it. And we're going to do this. Bitsy, teeny bit of jetage. Uh, roll it. We also need pitch control, don't we? Mm, yes, we do. Actually, that's pointless, so. Let's go here, let's here, here, and also here, and here. We got a little bit of roll control. That. Mm. Mm. Alright, we do need some pitch control. We do need some pitch, and I know how to do that, thankfully, without using any power. Surfaces. Now let's see if she can dance. <laughs> and she's gonna be a fast girl. She's gonna get in nice and close <laughs> and uh, wreck shop a little bit. in there. And it's Alright, we need uh, more hydrofoils uh, in the front by the looks of it. In fact, that's exactly what we're gonna give it. The suspension is as stiff as it can get, yes. Uh, oh no, one, two, three, four, okay. Hydrofoils. So many hydrofoils.
let's go to dry. There we go. Oh, she's flying. She's humming right along. Look at her. Actually, let's go find those ACPs, otherwise we're gonna run out of juice. Yeah, we jamming. Mm-hmm. I like it. All right. Let's see here. Adjustments. Maneuver. Uh, fix. All right. Mm-hmm. Needs the shark eye decal. It's actually going to have moth uh, decals, uh, by the way. So, just to give you an idea... a short idea this thing's not quite finished we've done very well making the turrets ahead of time was a smart move it was a big brain move if i do say so myself so where is the thingy uh, not that thingy the other thingy uh, there it is uh, hologram projector so that and i'm just gonna fire up notepad and make the moth uh, that I uh, made uh, last night a reality. There we go. Let me moth go. Damn it. Hello. Okay, you can stop now. And one, two, three, four. Why is no why is this not working? Am I blind or stupid or something? It's small. Okay. Uh, why is that link not working? Just double check it's working here. Yeah, it's working. Okay. Oh, there it is. Okay. And... So, here's our moth. It's going to be three meters up in the air. One, four, four. There we go. We got a nice pale moth. Seven. Is that too much? That is too much. There we go. So there is one moth. Yeah, let's put that moth on the sides as well. Now, why not, I say? Uh, we're right here. Okay. 
play the projector? Nope. Uh, project range zero. Whoops. Always do this, jeez. Check it, yep. We just need to reverse this. Oops. We got moths! It does kind of look like a uh, a bird uh, went poopy on it, but um, we can fix that. All right, so now let's put some turret restrictions in place because we do need those. Okay, first I'm gonna celebrate the moth and by cracking open a cold one. Yum. Yeah, we could give this thing holographic moth wings. We could totally do that. I need to go off and draw that, though, so maybe not immediately, but we will do that. No worries. I'm having a good time. Ooh, good time, good time. Cheers, my friends. Lighty who then, and then we go here. This thing doesn't need anything like that, so we're just gonna go over here. And yet da 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 yet da 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 da. Ooh, excuse me. Ah, gassy gassy me me. Okay then. Yes, yes, yes. From the depths is fun. Do we say that enough? I think we should say that enough. There's so much stuff to do. There's so much little, you know, it's a works of craft. You get to be a craftsman. Can we just stop and appreciate that for a second? Back in the day, back in the day, if you wanted to make things of craft, you had to actually get your hands dirty. Now the only filth on my hands is from my keyboard, which I don't wash enough. Okay then, lovely, lovely, and let's spawn in... Let's spawn in a crossbones and see what happens. Because I think we're going to be able to shoot down... And watch the cram cannons get... Yep. <laughs> Don't miss with that cram shot. Oh. 
know what? Let's make the angle a little bit more interesting. Okay, this thing's actually kind of scary. <laughs> Alright, are we running out of juice? No, we're not. We are good for juice. We're good for juice. And just to show you what that uh, cram can do, yeah, that's... Uh, I think it just ripped through multiple layers of metal uh, quite nicely. Also... Damn, I, this thing's cool! Guys, this thing's cool! And that particle cannon just ate cram shots to the face and didn't die, so that's nice. Now the uh, now the the APS has gonna it's gonna take a while to reload. I should, you know what else I should do? I should stick some missile interceptors on this thing. How fast does this thing Oh, it goes almost 100 meters per second. That's plenty. <laughs> and goodbye, one cram cannon. Yep, and go zap, zap, zap. I'm starting to get the hang of seawiz, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, can it drive on land? That is the question. I'm open to names for the sun. The what? Uh, yeah, I should slap rubber on the front. You're absolutely correct. Absolutely correct, Amundo. We are giving the. This crossbow is the hiding of its life. Jeez. Fifty millimeters is friggin' ideal for uh is ideal for stuff. Hmm, Moth Princess. He's protection from getting red. I th things that move at 99 meters per second uh, tend to be very hard to ram. Um, even things that move faster than that have uh, trouble keeping up, and this thing uh, has pretty decent sewers on it, so... Yeah, I don't think uh, ramming is something this thing is going to be worried about. This is actually the first time I've made something like this, like a large, powerful hydrofoil like this. Some missile interceptors wouldn't go amiss, I think. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's gonna have some rubber. Okay, we get the idea. This thing can curb stomp a crossbones. You can go away. That's okay. Damn, guys. This thing's cool. I like it. Definitely not my usual style of vehicle, but uh, I'm happy I've made it because, uh, yeah, it's groovy. It is a groovy beast. Alright, we do need rubber though. We need rubber, 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 rubber. Why did I say it like that? I don't know. I wonder how torpedo-proof this thing is. Probably fairly torpedo-proof, to be honest. The things that move at about 100 meters per second tend to be. And... What was it? Here. Yep. 
Moth Princess. What's moth in Latin? Uh, somebody Google that for me, please. How do I ban people again? There we go. <laughs> uh, deactivate wheels while the water. I don't know. Don't think so. Do they even use power in the water? Uh, okay. Oh, freaking thing. Uh, Lepidoptera. Uh, well, powered wheels might be handy if the jets get shot off. Um, but yeah, they've, they've got slightly less power, so shouldn't be too much of an issue. Okay, you hold off for one moment. There we go. Me lass, me lassie. Terrain reporting. So now we gotta save this puppy and go into the land designer and see if she can roll around. Land designer. Whoops. Okay, where's the seed? There is the seed. Spawn in. What the hell? Oh, okay then. Um, that's not part of the plan. Although she's she's humming around on land just nicely. Yep, and can she go back onto land? Yeah, like a champion. All right. All right. Let's uh go find this. What happened here? for a second. What the balls happened here? Seriously, what happened? There we go. That's better. <laughs> I don't know if you can do that. Alright, so let us try this thing. Actually, it's too big. Uh, I mean, it's above the volume limit. But could use this thing in Ashes of the Empire, no problem. Damn. Princess Moth. I do like that. Moth Princess, Princess Moth. Hmm. All right, let's spawn in a big, scary airship. Spawn in an albacore, see how she does. Doesn't ha really have proper active defenses apart from Sea Wiz yet. And APS might give us a run for our money. Oh, this thing is death to frontsiders. It just gets right up in their faces. Also, this ground is very bright. Oh, but we've got hills to worry about. We got hills to worry about.
Uh oh, what the hell happened there? Oh, that. Oh, what the. Oh, that it must have col. Ah, oh, we need to put rubber on the sides. We need to put rubber on the sides. Them's the rules. Oof. We just, we just lost something else. What did we lose? Okay. New plan. Is more rubber all around. Lots of rubber. More rubber. You think we had enough rubber? Incorrect! More rubber is needed. Speaking mainly to myself on that one. Yeah, maybe, yeah, extend wheels a little bit more, I think. Yeah, that's gonna look a little bit funny, floaty wheels, but that's okay. That's okay. A-okay, I say. Where's that slope? There's that slope. Those all turning wheels, they are. Son of a bitch. Hmm. Oh, solid extend? Alright. Uh, solid extend. Oh my word, that's too much. Okay, let's do that. There we go. I do need rubber on the sides. Rubber, 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 rubber. Although, it is fun when your uh, craft's biggest enemy is itself. Kind of flattering. Okay, and we need some rubber. Where else do we need it? We need it here. We need it on the sides here. There we go. There we go. Oopsie daisy. There we go. Oopsie, oopsie. safety rubber for safety rubber for safety is a good thing and also need to put rubber on the back in case it drags its bum on the floor also here yeah, rubber 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 it does mean that it's going to get uh, these bits shot off more often than not but that's okay that's fine with me baby function yes brain Bra brain is functioning beep boop brain brain calculating brain calculating best thing to do beep boop beep boop beep 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 
boop, beep boop, wing, rubber, beep boop, beep, 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 is it, uh, yes it is, thank you, driver, that music's loud, next track, there we go, probably didn't need to, yeah, I actually didn't need to stick a thing on the top yet. Didn't need to do that. Mm. Having good time. Having good time. Where is the rubber? There it is. Rubber, rubber. Rubber, 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 rubber. Actually, I need to do the whole underside of this, don't I? Uh, I actually do. I totally need to do that. I totally need to do that. Otherwise, it's bad. Boop, 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 boop. Beep boop. Beep boop. Gathering data on from the depths. Optimum playstyle. Downloading. Error. Optimum playstyle not found. Beep boop. You know the stream has been going on a while. Uh, when I just turn into a robot. That happens, you know. Just get Harper. Is that the first time I've roboted on stream? Actually, robot so robot roboted sounds like a dirty euphemism, so let's not do that. Let's not do that. This could this could also collide with something. Damn it. You know what? I'm gonna be cheeky and just do Yes, there are. Well, actually, hang on, let's check. Uh, mimic. Nope, there are no rubber mimics. Sad face. Sad face, a sad day. Okay, we're almost done with the stream. Almost. Just need to rubber up the other jet over there. quite done. I just remembered that there's a... I've got other... Th I've got another thing. <laughs> I've got that freaking um, uh, space bomber I also gotta finish. Damn it. Completely forgot about it. To be perfect... To be honest with you, I was meaning to finish that in my spare time, but then I ran out of spare time. Uh, red bottom. Uh, doesn't really need one. I kind of like how this thing looks completely unpainted. Um, I don't know. I'll mess up. Uh, we can, uh, we can, uh, what we can try is different camos. I think this thing would look really good in a night camo. Because uh, it'll help those moths pop. Those, uh, get those moths popping, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You're picking up what I'm putting down. 
You smelling what I'm stepping in? Oh boy. Okay, what else? What else? What else? Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? The Moth Popper. A good nickname for this thing, actually. Oh, dang it. Yeah, we do need, uh... We need, uh... We need some of this. Just a little bit. Whoops. go with this thing is all terrain as balls now let's test it again oh yeah headlights that's good lights 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 oh yeah you know what else, else is a good idea with this there we go uh, where can we stick lights let us stick lights here let's stick spotlights here spotlights Very big. Intensity is 10. Whoops. Let's set that to 90. Whoops. There we go. Ah. How's that? <laughs> You'll You'll definitely see this thing coming. Uh, that might be too bright, actually. But, uh, let's dial that down just a little bit. Just five. Nice, 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 nice. Is it using glass? Light? Man, I like this thing. It looks, it looks cool. It looks sci-fi. It dare I say it looks baller. <laughs> Yeah, this thing goes incredibly fast on land. Oh boy. Um, let's spawn an albacore again, see how we do. Yeah, it's gonna need decoys and interceptors and all that jazz. Actually, let's do let's turn it to night. See how this looks. Oh yeah, baby, you're gonna see me coming. <laughs> Taillights on the road. Street legal? Dude, where we're going, we don't need streets. Is that cram cannon actually gonna hit it? Nope, it isn't. I don't have any rear-facing uh, munition warners, I just realized.
Damn. Can it outrun the singularity turning? Probably not. Okay, it's not... This thing isn't complete. Well, you know what? Um, the singularity is going to melt it, but what we can do is see if it can damage the singularity. And also see if... Um, let's, just turn it, let's just turn it on god mode. And spawn in the singularity. Uh, all the times, thank you. See if we can get up in the singularity's face without it uh, walking away. Yeah. So, we're getting nice and close. Oh my good, I forgot about the particle cannon that I just built. Oh my word, we're up in the singular. Well, the singularity would already have murdered us but uh, by now, but yeah. Wait, does the singularity have particle cannons? Did I just hallucinate that? It does! When did it get those? Yeah, a few missile interceptors. Wow, it just ate that entire volley. Deacon's Christmas. Yeah. Well, this is the this is on the right track for an anti-singularity vehicle. This one wouldn't be able to do it um, because the split second I turn God mode off. Well, uh, you know, lasers, uh, lasers are a problem. Lasers and all the missiles and all that stuff. So yeah, this is uh, not. Not a singularity proof vehicle, though. It's a proof of concept. How many to kill a singularity? Probably too many. Probably uh, laggy amounts. But I reckon we might be able to. What can we give? Uh... Now, nah, goshawk would probably be too much for this thing. I although I don't know. I don't know. Let's spawn in a goshawk and see what happens. It might disintegrate us completely. I mean, we're definitely hurting it. So we appear to be out of its firing arc. Well, I say that. Again, proof of proof of concept, if nothing else, is that uh, this thing, two of them, might be able to manage it. I love the gentle country music playing while this serious battle happens. Uh oh, I think our steering's a little bit, uh, a little bit messy. Yep, we've got some problems. <laughs> I mean, the Meg has pretty good, uh, close in weapon defense. Can you please? Why is this not working? Oh, it did work. That's why it worked. Well, I call this thing a success. Uh, let's sport it in against, uh, just for giggles. Let's sport it in against the Tarpon. Because it's roughly the same cost. I wouldn't say that uh, the Megalodon's Kryptonite is a... Uh... Oh, you know what would have been a good idea? Reloading. Reloading would have been a good idea. Oh, we're getting eaten alive. Bugger. Now 
now this is just a test to see how tough this thing is. Also, annoyingly, that cram cannon still misses at, like, really close range. Dig it. Okay, now we're firing back. That's nice. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> this thing... Guys, this thing is not small. This thing is, a. Uh, it's 8,000 blocks, 130 meters long, and it's the same cost as the tarpon, so small is uh, not, uh, wouldn't describe this thing as a small thing. You know what, I should test it against the Banshee, or maybe something else. Uh, actually, let's actually reload our stuff. And a spawn, Banshee. Actually, Banshee's too... What's it? What's that other thing? Uh, that's, uh... Forgotten completely. Uh, I'll know it when I see it, the other thing. It's like the bigger, meaner version of the... Of the, uh, of the Banshee. Alrighty, what, uh, what the hell was it called? The Spectre. Where the hell is the Spectre? Oh, there it is. Let's test against this fella. See how well we do. Probably not doing super well, because we need more missile defense than that. Also, I think a missile just warped inside us. And that's bad. I mean, we did just take that volley like a champ. Like an absolute champion. We need, uh, we need some, uh, we need some decoys or something. Is that cram cannon gonna hit anything? Kind of. <laughs> it hit the superstructure. Okay, let's moderate shit for a hot second. Huh, apparently ST, uh, IC is misogynistic. I didn't know that. Okay. Uh, small toad detection sake. Okay, we have been going for over two hours, so I am going to stop there. You head over there, me girl. Me lassie, me fine one. Uh, I'm totally gonna take some beauty shots right here. Yeah, work it, girl. Work it. Yeah. Mmm, yeah. Make love to the camera. Uh, yeah, okay. I think that'll do for this stream, guys. We've uh, been going two hours. We've done great work. I like this thing. This thing's cool. It's different from what I usually do. It's got, it's got crams, it's got APS, it's what, I mean, freaking hell. It's a hydrofoil, which I never build, and it's got functioning seawiz on it. Like, that's amazing. I, I never do that, but I've done it now, and the thing doesn't even look that much like a canoe, despite people saying otherwise. So yeah, uh, see you guys, um, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, you know the drill, like and follow and subscribe on Twitch, like, follow and subscribe on YouTube, I have a Patreon, I have YouTube membership, I have Twitch subscribers, you know the, you know, you know the stuff, so, um, 
Yeah, thank you all so much for joining me. This is a gr this was a great stream. I love this. I love this. So yeah, I will see you next time, same time, same place. And if I do any surprise streams any uh, between now and then, I'll be sure to let you know. So yeah, thank you very much. Have a good one. Bye. So yeah, have a good have a good one. I said that again. Bye.